Here's what flooding looked like around Tampa Bay on Wednesday. Tampa Bay Times, St. Petersburg, Florida. Heavy thunderstorms dumped rain over much of the Tampa Bay area Wednesday afternoon, stranding motor. ISDS and prompting a flood advisory for areas including Hillsborough, Pinellas and Pasco Counties th. At expired at 7.45 p.m. Tampa Bay is in the middle of peak rainy season, when meteorologists expect about two-thirds of the area's annual rainfall will occur. The region has seen more rain than Below are your comments. Florida has always flooded. Remember at one time Florida was mostly wetlands and in the 70s and 80 feet. S government allowed building on wetlands. In Tampa the Six Mile Creek, runoff canal, was established help with flooding. Everyone knew if a storm came in, Davis Island and TGH would be underwater. Hyde Park always underwater. Now climate change has fueled more severe downpours of rain. And there is nothing that will fix the problem immediately. So stop crying, clean up, dry up, and wa. It for the next storm. Overdevelopment of Florida means there's not even ground available to absorb groundwater. Quit building over my swamp. Dot. Problem is we keep getting hit with heavy rain right at the same time as high tide. When the tide is in there is nowhere for all the rain runoff to run off to. Reporters had to drive all around Tampa to find PNTER sections filled with intersections filled with water due to poor drainage. If Kamala gets elected she'll fix this. Please subscribe to my channel. And if you like it, please thumbs up.